Kenny Green, raw perspective, concrete and steel, keeping it good and raw. Community and unity is important. Hit them subscribes. Let's get at it. Today, I got to talk about the passing of the legendary GOAT, Quincy Jones. We all know him. And guess what? What he contributed to music. He has shaped the sound of music. He's touched different eras at a young man, 14, 15 years old. He's arranging for Count Basie. He's dealing with Ray Charles doing his music. So this is a beautiful thing. When people was trying to figure out what they're going to do at 14, 15, he was doing it. You know what I'm saying? He got 28 Grammys. 80 Grammy nominations. Man, you hear what I'm saying? 80 Grammy nominations, man. It's a true GOAT in the game. And, you know, let's not talk about the elephant in the room. Thriller, Michael Jackson. As a youngster, <clears throat> um, everybody was waiting. I think it was MTV where they premiered that Thriller video. And it was so much hula around it, man. Everybody sat by their TVs. And we never saw nothing like that. That was cute. That was Quincy. You know what I'm saying? We never saw nothing like that. To this day, that was one of the most selling albums ever. We going to Off the Wall. Michael Jackson, Off the Wall. Man, genius. Genius. And it doesn't stop there. The, the range, like Frank Sinatra. Take me over the moon. Come on, man. Scores the color purple. He's done everything. He's done everything. And he's definitely going to be missed. You know what I mean? But every now and then, one of those greats come that leaves so much that we'll be listening forever. You know, it's just like his body of work is so vast, you know, from... Um, being a young man getting called on to do the Frank Sinatra song, you know, I think it's over the moon, you know, it's just so many different, um, um, contributions that he's added. And just mind you, I cannot name them all because I know I don't know them all. That's what I'm saying about Quincy, the Q. And then in his later years, he put some game down in the rap industry. He's on some songs and he's always been a mentor, a guy that a lot of the musicians and people could go to and get some instruction, some understanding, some clarity about sounds and different things. Because like I said before, Quincy is the true goat. Condolences to the family. He's going to be missed. But he left something here that we can all be thankful. Peace out, concrete steel.